Mr. Wong had 100 more goldfish than angelfish in his aquarium. After selling one quarter of his goldfish and one fifth of the angelfish, he found that he had 30 more angelfish than goldfish. The goldfish was sold at $5 each and the angelfish was sold at $4 each. How much money did he receive in all? If you read this question, you realize that it's actually similar to the question above, right? Yeah. Okay, for the banning of fate of those who skip question 3 because you told me you do not know how to solve, after I teach this question, you better go and redo your question 3. Okay? I'm going to draw my before model first to show my goldfish and my angelfish. And my goldfish will be 100 more than my angelfish. Correct? After selling one quarter of his goldfish, so I need to cut my goldfish into one quarter, right? Okay, so this 100, right? I must also cut into quarters, right? Yeah. Let's stop the rubbish. Or else I'll stuff a ball of paper into your mouth. Okay, so I'm going to cut this 100. This is used to be my 100. Yeah. I'm going to cut it into 25s. Yes or no? Yeah. 25 each. Okay. For the angel fish, I'm going to sell away one fifth, right? So for the angel fish model, I need to cut into how many units? Five, right? Okay. So I'm going to cut my angel fish into five. One, two, three, four, five, right? So looking at this, we know that this part is four units, am I right? Yes. And this is five units. Yes. What should I do next, uh, Adriana? So... What, what is the lowest common multiple? 20 units, right? Correct. Because uh, I have 5 units and 4 units, right? Correct. You can draw in the rest on your own, right? Okay. Now, I saw away... What, Mr. Wong saw away 1 quarter of his goldfish. So, goldfish, angelfish... After selling away one quarter, how many units is he left with, Leroy? Leroy, I told you you are so weak in uh, mathematics that... It's not. He's really weak in mathematics. He's really in trouble. You see, even Sky wants to shout the answer. 15 units! What's wrong with you? <laughs> even, huh? <laughs> was that the truth or was that a lie? <laughs> okay. So is my after model for my goldfish complete, Sky? Why is it incomplete? Laughing aside, you all better know how to draw this uh, model, okay? It's important. Okay, right. So this is my goldfish model. Is it complete right now, Tsinkai? It's complete, right? So Tsinkai, since it's complete, can you give me my angelfish model? How should I, it be like? You should have 16 units, right? Because he sold away one fifth, that means he's left with four fifths. And 4 fifths, since you know that one box is 4 units, 4 fifths means uh, 16, right? 4 times 4. Correct, you have uh, 16 units. And then you have uh, 30 angelfish. Sorry, uh, this is really not drawn to scale. Uh. 
This is 16 units. How I know I need to draw like this? Because he had 30 more angel fish than goldfish, right? Sorry, uh, it's really not drawn to scale, but you know the idea, right? Okay. So now, Leroy, form the equation. Hey, Jack, stop it. Uh. Thank God. Okay, so now we know that one unit is uh, 105. The number of goldfish sold is actually uh, goldfish that's sold, uh, okay, is actually 5 units plus 25, correct? Which is 105 times 5, which equals to how much? 3? How much? How many? How many goldfish is it sold? Five hundred and fifty goldfish. Then what about angel fish that's sold? It's only five five units, right? No, four units. Which is actually hundred and five times four, which is actually four hundred and. So to find the amount of money collected. Times five dollars, right? Plus four twenty times four, which will give me how much? Four thousand four hundred and twenty dollars. Thirty dollars. Okay. So this is the answer. Sorry, I don't have enough space to write the ANS, so you write it on your own. Any, anyone has any problem? No. So this is really similar to the question in question 3. So those who did not do question 3, right? Didn't do question 3, right? Is it question 3 or question 2? Question 3, right, Adriana? So they all know how to do question 3, right? Yeah. Okay. So the last question. Who's the one who says the same thing? Okay, you know why? Right? Because he, now he's trying to solve all his questions in terms of units and parts now. I think that's what you're trying to do. I can see a lot of you, you are trying to solve most of your questions in units and parts. Like Yun Song also. Everything units, parts, units, parts, units, parts, units, parts. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, let's look at question 5. The ratio of the red beads to yellow beads, okay, red to yellow, is actually 4 is to 5. Now, 40 red beads were lost and 50 yellow beads were bought. The ratio became 4 is to 7, right? So, red is to yellow, become 4 is to 7. Yeah, I should write before and after. Okay. So I think all of you know how to solve this question personally. Okay. So for you, five U, four P, seven P. So you all know how to solve it. Okay. I'm going to start your homework then.